I want to share a story of when I was standing on a bridge near where I used to live, looking at the waves crashing. And for about 30 seconds, I contemplated jumping. I thought to myself, what a perfect way to end this suffering, the pain that is coming. I was in a full out burnout. And this was the second time in my life that I felt that dying was the best solution. The first time was when I overworked myself so much that I fell asleep at the wheel uh, in broad daylight and crashed into the window of a basement apartment in the building next to where I used to live. I should have died that day. And to my surprise, I, a miracle happened. My uh, chair reclined so that my head didn't get cut off. And I came out with minor bruises on my face uh, eight chipped teeth and horrible whiplash. It was a scene of a movie, ambulance, fire truck, police cars, uh, news anchors, the whole neighborhood came out to see what all the commotion was about, including my husband. And he really thought it was a movie. And then he looked at the car hanging in the window and he thought to himself hmm, that kind of looks like uh, our car so he went closely and saw the license plate his knees gave good thing people were around him to hold him up and let him know oh, she's okay she's okay i was okay i was alive I was rushed to the hospital and brought back the same day at home because I did not look like someone who just had such a traumatic accident. So I should have been really happy to be alive, but I find myself wishing I had died. And I realized how sick my soul was. And so I took time off recuperated, got better, put some strategies in place. But a few years after, I went back to my old ways and crashed again. And this time it was my body and my mind that crashed. So here I was on the bridge contemplating suicide. And that's when I realized that I needed help. I needed professional help to get at what that source was that was causing me to overwork myself to death. And so I stopped again, focused on myself, did the inner work, got the healing I needed, and I started living from the inside out. I started being before doing. And I also found my calling realizing that what happened to me is not in vain. And now I help others with their own mental health journey. I've been in recovery for seven years now, loving life, doing what I love and loving what I do. So I want to say it's possible to be mentally healthy and wealth and in wealth. Thank you for hearing my story.